What's up YouTube, it's me DrummerBoy0109 and today guys I am here with another Minecraft Pocket Edition mod showcase for 0.14.0. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Beacons mod and Beacons are actually originally from Minecraft PC and they are in the other versions of Minecraft. So yeah, if you guys are enjoying this uh, series of mod reviews, make sure you do drop a like and leave some support, share this on Twitter, share it on Google+, wherever you want so I can get this out to people and they can see this awesome mod. So yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into this. Alright guys, once you have installed this mod, what you're going to need to do is you're going to have to collect different types of ores. Now, any of the ores can be gold, emerald, diamond, or iron, and you're going to have to get them in blocks and also in an ingot shape. So yeah, once you have that, we can actually go ahead and start developing this. Now, to make the beacon work, you're going to have to build a pyramid with the blocks. Now, you can do any of these four, like I said, any of these will work, but you have to keep it in like that form. Like, you can't have a diamond and emerald go together. It has to be just diamond or just emerald. And in order to make this work, you're going to have to make it in a pyramid shape. So there's different types of pyramids, there's the 3x3, there's the 5x5, there's the 7x7, and then there's the 9x9, and it decreases as it goes up. Like if you have a 9x9, you have a 7x7, a 5x5, and 3x3, and then you put a beacon on top. So yeah, I know that might have been a little confusing, but I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to make it yourself. So we're going to start with the block of emerald. It can be any of these, but we're going to do block of emerald, and we're going to do a 3x3. So this is a 3x3, and then you just throw a beacon on top, and then it will work but say I wanted to do a 5x5, five five, all you have to do is place this like this and make it 5x5, five five. so let's do that quickly. Fill in all this area, here's 5x5, five five. fill that in, and then on top you're gonna have to do a 3x3. Three three. So you have it going around like that, and then you can place a beacon and then the beacon will go ahead and transmit the beam on top. Now, for Minecraft Pocket Edition, you can't actually go through them, but in PC and others, you can actually go through them. So this is about it. You're gonna have to do a few more things, but this is the basic setup for the beacon. So then you go up to it and tap it. And there's different types of powers that you can do. You're gonna have to choose a primary primary power, and the secondary power will be there for you, which is regen. Um, but the primary powers can be haste, uh, they can be speed, they can be jump boost, um, resistance, and then there's also another one. I'm not quite sure what that uh, sword one is, but I'm guessing it's like some type of strength, possibly. Uh, yeah, it's, I think it's strength. And in order to get them, you're gonna have to do different levels. To get the strength, you're gonna actually have to make it uh, more than this like more than five by five uh, it won't actually work you're gonna have to make it seven by seven um, and then nine by nine it will work with any of these but if you want to have like if you want to have the jump boost and you want to have resistance you're gonna have to make it five by five but if you just want to stick with the simple things like haste and speed um, then you're just gonna have to make it three by three so <laughs> well, that's a lot of talking. Let's go ahead and click this and actually do something So we're gonna put haste on here And then you're going to put in like a diamond or any of the things in your inventory and then click go And then it will go ahead and start working and transmit the things uh, So let's go ahead and just put a couple in there and now you can see it's starting to work and I will have haste Which will allow me to break um, that I can actually break things faster, but because I'm in creative mode it doesn't really get affected so let's go ahead and come over here and we're going to go ahead and add in jump boost we're going to put in some gold and then we will have jump boost and you can see i'm actually jumping a lot higher now depending on the range um that you are within the beacon you will actually have like the time will um, stay going and you'll actually have the effect but if I am out of range of the beacon say I go all the way over here my effect will go down and will go ahead and decrease all the way seven six five four three two one you can see my haste is going away and my jump is gone away and I no longer have those effects so yeah it was probably a lot to um, explain I'm not the best at it uh, sorry if I messed anything up but that's basically it for the beacons if you guys want to get this mod you can go ahead and download it yourself and try it out the link will be down below in the description please drop a like let's see if we can get a hundred likes on this mod review that'd be awesome that's pretty much it see you guys and gals and stay cool bye